All right, time for our Monday Manners visit with etiquette expert Diane Gotsman, who says she has literally been getting swamped right. with wedding etiquette mm -hmm. questions. Yes. Wedding okay. season. Yeah. It's time. So we, since we've got a, a full in. At least one a day, right? So one yeah. a day. So oh, how, oh, when do you start getting offended when you keep getting the shower invitations I, from, from the same, same wedding? Person. Okay, the here's, same. here's the thing. I once had this. I won't name names, but I once, oh, she might be watching. What? Um, <laughs> oh, say it. No, no I good. just, I had, I had, and they're both my best friends. I had one girlfriend who scheduled the shower at the same day our other girlfriend did oh. in two different oh. cities. It was... That's so, yeah, right there. Yeah, wow. yeah, are they hard. really good friends? That's, no, yeah. the, tip. that's, the, that's the protocol tip because the hosts should talk to the well, and, I, and, I, and I will I will say um, the the one girlfriend she didn't plan the wedding. Her future sister-in-law planned. Yeah. Part of me the, the shower. Sure. So, but it was it's ooh. it's hard. Mm -hmm. So I think that two is optimum. Two, yes. Three is getting too many. Mm -hmm. And you know sometimes you have to pick and choose which one you're going to go to. Not because you prefer one over the other, but you are SVP'd to one and then can't cancel for the next. Is it one. okay to just go to one? Well, if you're available to go to both, really? if you don't have a conflict, oh, you mean for the same person? Yes. yes. So it's okay to go, just go to one. Okay. You just, you just RSVP? No. You mm -hmm. know, you don't have to give an excuse, but you shouldn't be invited to the same shower. <laughs> That's the bottom line. <laughs> okay. the, the host should get together and determine who's going to be invited to what shower, mm -hmm. so, and especially if there's three and four, and there should not be. <laughs> you know, there should not be. Right. Okay. Can the mother of the bride be one of the hosts of the shower? No. No. no? Now, the reality is, Mothers of the bride sometimes that. are, and the etiquette rules have gotten a little softer on that. But the reality is, if possible, you don't want the mother of the bride hosting the Why shower is that? because it feels a little bit as if you're asking for gifts. Mm. You know, it's it it should be. Uh, held by the bridesmaids, by close friends, distant family yeah, members. A sister. a sister is still really it's close. Now, yeah. if those are the only people who are going to host the shower for you, yeah. and you may not know, you know, they may live in another city right. and they mm -hmm. want to have a gathering with the people they know, so that's fine. So there's some wiggle room, but I would prefer not. Plus okay. they're paying for a big chunk of the wedding. Yes, they are. All right. Yes. All right, from the... Uh, now, is it obligatory for the bridesmaids to host one? So, so you shouldn't do it, or you know, should you do it? Obligatory is a is a tough word yeah. because it's like a, a gift is not obligatory. But generally, the bridesmaids do host the shower because if the maid of honor only hosts the shower because she should host the shower mm -hmm. and the bridesmaids don't help, that gets pricey. Okay. And she also hosts the bachelorette party. That's right. There's a lot of money involved in being a, an attendant, mm -hmm. a bridesmaid. Maid of honor. All right, how about this one? We've ta I think we've talked about this one before. You're not invited to the wedding. Can you still be invited to a shower? That's a big no. 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 That's no. Rude. <laughs> yes. Yeah, okay. <laughs> We're moving on. Don't, don't do that. Don't that crash it. Um, can you ask each guest to pay at a wedding shower luncheon? Okay, so if you are a host, no, because a host pays and mm -hmm. tips if you are at a at a restaurant. Mm -hmm. But if you are just getting everyone together and let's all honor so and so for her wedding, upcoming wedding, that's different. And then everybody would pay and then also pay for the bride. But that's really not a shower. No, it's that's right. just a yeah, lunch. It's just yeah, it's yeah. A different deal. Together. Yes. It could be one of your more than two events. Yes. You can then. still bring a gift though. You can you absolutely can bring a gift. Right. But it, 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 the question is, can you ask each guest to pay? You should not. Okay, and how about this one? Do you have to give the guest a nice party favor when you're at the shower? Well, I think it would be nice if you're mm -hmm. the host and you give the, each guest something as they leave. Maybe a cookie with, mm -hmm. you know, the initials. Get or, me to the shower. Yes, you know, I just went to one and they gave away a little nail polish and it said, it said something about weddings, like mm -hmm. bridal yeah. slipper or something, and it was real cute. Yeah, any yeah. thoughtful gesture is always encouraged. Doesn't have to be expensive. Okay, so that's uh, kind of some good questions there. So many questions, like you said, you've been getting, and it's tough, like you said, there's no one size fits all. Yes. But, but some of those are kind of common sense about what's normally been done in the past. Try to stick and, with that. And one more question is, how much input does the bride have on the shower? And the answer is minimal. Oh, okay. Believe it or not, minimal. So they can ask. Um, They're going to try to work the back channel sometime. <laughs> yeah. Right, that's why the mother of the bride or the bride sometimes is going to be more involved. Yes. No, I just, they got enough on their just plate. Just real quick question. What about uh, co-workers? Do you have to invite your co- well, I guess this is the... I, it's, I'm just if curious. Fine, like I'm them, not you going. Can, you don't have to. <laughs> I'm going to get you You don't have polish. to, but if you like <laughs> them, um, certainly you can. Okay. Just be careful because you, like you can't invite one and then leave out the others. It'll hurt right. feelings. So next time, bachelor party <laughs> etiquette? Yeah, next time. Oh, All right. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Great lead into the next shot. Yeah. Already, Diane. <laughs> we'll never see Diane again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That was it. All right, we appreciate it as always, man. Good stuff.